Hello everyone, welcome back to the Sports Vault. I'm Joe Archino and I'm joined by one of the stars of the Iona men's basketball team, Sam Cassell Jr. Sam, thanks for being on the show today. Let's get right into things. You know, the MAC tournament is this week and it's as big as it gets, but we're gonna reflect a little bit before we kind of get into the big prize that's on the line. When you kind of go back to the first time you suited up as a Gale, what's different now from then? Um, I see from our first game we played against Florida State, the team chemistry wasn't there because it was a lot of new guys, but now as the season went on, I know where guys' favorite spots are, where they want to be, and like where they want where they want the ball to score. So I know everybody's game, so that, that makes things easier for me as the point guard. Was it, I mean, how was difficult was that learning curve for you, kind of getting used to playing with your new teammates, new offense, new coach, new everything, really? Um, it was very hard. Uh, yeah, like you said, new everything. Like, who wants to go into new situations, uh, especially that last year? But it was a learning experience, and it was a, it was a mental thing for me also to come here and try to lead the guys who was younger than me, to, basically to teach them things. So, and also they teaching me, because it was it was it's just as hard as for them, uh, me coming and and then me getting here, then uh, just like them. And, I mean, obviously, you are a big name in the UConn program. What's different from being in that storied basketball program and then being in this one in, at Iona? Uh, it's not very different. It's just uh, TV. That's the only thing. Like, almost every game is on ESPN. Uh, we have a lot of games at ESPN3, but uh, then the love – the love is the same. The Iona fans love their team just the same way the UConn fans does. I'm enjoying my time here. The Maroon Maniacs are as good as it gets, and they certainly will be there during the weekend as Iona goes to the Times Union Center in Albany for the MAC tournament. Let me ask you, obviously you know that the team was able to win the championship last year. What do you think it's going to take for them to repeat as champions this season? Uh, everybody has to, 1 through 12, 1 through 15 we have on our team, including the coaching staff. Everybody has to be on the same page and has to bring energy each and every night because we're we the defending champs, so the bullseye's on our back. So we have to be ready for every punch everybody throw. How do you prepare for that, you know, mentally? Is there anything, is there a ritual you do, anything specific that you do to get your, your mindset ready for games that are as big as it gets? Uh, it's playoff time. It's one and done. Nobody wants to be watching uh, these games Saturday, Sunday. So, you know, you have to go out there and give your, your 110 percent. If you give anything less than that, you know you don't have a chance of winning the game. Well, then finally, I'll ask you this. I think we all expect you guys to get it done, but what, what would it mean to you to be able to say, I was an Iona Mac champion? Uh, goes down in history. I won't never be forgotten here about, about this 2016-2017 team. I'll be a champion. Uh, I know if I come back here, uh, I'll probably, I will get love because who doesn't, who doesn't want a championship? And for me, it's a personal goal because everywhere I went, I didn't want a championship, so I want to keep that going.